Uh, hey everybody, Ray O'Brien here. Welcome to It's All About the Cocktail. So tonight I want to make, go make myself a quick mule with a Jack Daniels honey. But I want to show you how easy this is. Something you can do very quickly. Okay, this is what I call the JD Kicking Mule. Okay, it's very easy to make. Jack Daniels honey, a little Nyhoff jalapeno honey liqueur, some lime, and some crushed ice, and a couple drops of orange bitters. So let's begin! Okay, first thing you want to do is get yourself a nice cold glass. First thing you want to do is put one ounce of your Nyhoff honey jalapeno liqueur. This I got from Boris and Yurata, my friends, over the summer. This stuff is great. The next thing you want to do is put two ounces of your Jack Daniels honey in there. And then I got myself some big old fre fresh limes. I'm going to do that behind the bar so I don't get it all over. I had, I had an axe and my arm's kind of screwed up, so bear with me. So we're talking about a half ounce of lime. And then what we're going to do is we're just going to give that, hit that with a couple couple drops of orange bitters. This is your Angostura orange bitters. This is easy to get. I saw this at Walmart. It gets very easily. Hit that with a couple drops of that. Okay. Now we're just going to give that a shake. Pop our top on there. Bang our bottles, give it a shake for like maybe 10 seconds. Try to look cool while we're doing it. Okay, pop our top off. What we're gonna do then is we're gonna grab ourselves some ice and fill up what we call our Lewis bag. Our Lewis bag is nothing more than a canvas bag, and then we're just gonna beat the hell out of it. Okay, this is your Lewis bag. Put it on hard surface, and then grab yourself a big old mallet, and then beat the hell out of it. Then I'm going to grab myself a nice cold glass out of our chiller. Now I'm going to always tell you, if you don't got a chiller, just grab yourself, grab yourself a glass, throw some ice in there, and let it sit on the side. Then your glass got nice and cold. When you're ready for the drink, just pour it out, pour out the ice. And this is going to be tough for me not to spill it all over the place, but... Oh yeah, perfect, right? Okay, you did manage to get it some all over the place. Then what you want to do is you want to just grab yourself a Hawthorne strainer, pop it on your top, and pour that in the glaze. Leave yourself a little room because you're going to have to put some ginger beer in there. Then you just want to pour yourself some ginger beer in there. I like these little Q ginger beer cans because the Q ginger beer has got a nice, sharp, crisp taste to it. And the cans are smaller, so you can open up, you don't, you don't feel bad about it. Not not drink another another gin not make another drink because you gotta use up your ginger beer. They're pretty small things. And you just wanna pour yourself a little ginger beer in there. And then you just wanna put yourself a nice, nice little garnish on there. Put it in there, put it in there, let it, let it sit in the glass. This year, JD kicking mule. Let's check it out. Mm, wow, that's good. Refreshing man. I mean even though it's jalapeno honey liquor. You know, it's not, it's not hot at all. It's very refreshing, as a matter of fact. So check this out. This is your JD Kicking Mule. Check one of these out. I think you'll like it. I'll see you just in time for the next round. Catch you later.